Hello, today we're going to be taking a look at Thrive Themes. Thrive Themes is a site that is dedicated to WordPress themes and plugins. In particular, with the Thrive Themes membership that you purchase, you are going to be getting a, um, a particular feature, which we're going to be looking at, which is known as the Thrive Architect, or previously the Thrive Content Builder. Um, this is a WYSIWYG, what you see is what you get editor that makes making professional, beautiful templates for WordPress super, super easy. Gives you a lot of control over how you can design your layout. Um, and it makes it just really instant Tanya's feedback and in how you see your design. So if you're familiar with WordPress, while it is a great platform for building simple blogs, when it gets a little bit more technical, when it gets more complex, you either need to have a designer, you need to have somebody who knows code, or you need to you know adjust the code yourself. Well, with editors like um, Thrive's Architect from Thrive Themes, you can do all of this very, very simply. Um, and it's as simple as just creating a page and using the editor. So you install the plugin here. And once you have that, I'm gonna go ahead and add a new page here. So you can see here, I now have my test page set up. And what I can do is I have the ability to edit such test. And what you can see here is I have my test page set up. This is just a blank test page. And you can see you have the standard you know, WordPress editor, but I can go ahead and click on this button right here, the edit with Thrive Architect button. And that will take me into the um, Thrive Architect editor. Uh, and again, this is really, really great because you can see here, um, all of this is just a sidebar here, and then you have the main content here, um, and you get to preview this. And it's built off of this kind of a rapid integration technology. Essentially, whatever you update automatically will show you on the page here. No need to preview, no need to refresh. You simply can drag and drop or use one of their many templates. So for example here, if I go into uh, their page setup and I go ahead and choose this uh, landing page template here, you can see they have a ton of different templates that they offer you here. I'm gonna go ahead and just filter templates by tags. So let's say I was looking to make like a sales page. I can go ahead and click on the sales page templates and see all of their sales page. So let's say I like this one right here, the know how long images sales page. I'll go ahead and choose that template. And then just like that, it's gonna go ahead and, and generate one that's already you know, beautifully designed. It's built and not just uh, in terms of looks, but also just feature wise to kind of optimize your site for um, you know, better SEO, better you know, uh, traffic conversion and stuff like that. And you can see just like that, we have a template that's imported here. Um, and they give you really great pointers on like what to fill in on these things. And you'll notice as I hover over elements of the uh, page here, everything is editable. And that's the whole click to edit um, uh, functionality that they believe in, in Thrive Architect. Anything you click on here can be edited. So for example, if I was to click on this headline right here, I can go into the heading here and say, you know, this is a heading or I can say, you know, sales page. Um, and I can go ahead and just easily edit that. I can edit things like bold, underline, italics, all of those, you know, text tools here. For buttons, I can click on this. I can choose input the text options. You can see you can edit it either on the actual content portion and also on the left sidebar here, you have all sorts of options to adjust how it looks and, you know, sets on the page there. Additionally, all these elements are just, you can see I can easily just click on single elements here to edit them. I can adjust things like background styles, layout and position. Um, the typography. So if I want to adjust it, you know, to have like a shadow or uh, borders, I can do all of that right here very, very simply. So you can see I added a shadow behind that button. Again, you get to control everything and you get to see it in real time, which is a real big benefit to Thrive Architect. Uh, now, that being said, um, of course, if you don't want to use a template, you can, of course, use uh, their elements and just build your page from scratch. And that's the real great benefit with something like Thrive Ar Architect. Everything is just drag and drop. I can go here and let's say I wanted a heading, you know, let's say I want a heading right here. I can go and just drag this header and just let it go. And just like that, I now have a header. So I can say like the about us section, for example, if I was trying to partition off this page. And just like that, I now have a heading, just that simple, that easy. Um, if I want to make a completely, you know, let's go ahead here, let's go ahead and revert to um, the default here. So we'll go ahead and clear all this content. We'll make a default page here. And actually for that matter, let's just go ahead and, um, let's go ahead and go to a basic theme here. So let's go ahead and change the landing page uh, theme. So we'll go back here, we'll revert to theme and then we're gonna go ahead and just have a basic layout, just the, the simple layout that the site has here. And then I'm gonna go ahead and build it from scratch. So I can take a column here. I can say if I wanted a column right there, I can select the type of columns. You can see it really gives you a ton of options here, whether you want two column site, four column site, 
let's say I want like a half and half, and then I can adjust the columns in themselves. I can adjust the background style. I can adjust the borders and the corners here. I can decide like how thick the actual pixels are, as you can see there. Um, I can add animations if I want to add animations on how they uh, drop content. So you can have it slide for the top, for example, and have that animation loop. Um, you can just do all sorts of really amazing things that doesn't require any code. Um, however, if you do ever at one point want to add stuff like that, they do have options for you to add CSS and things of that nature. Um, another really great thing behind the whole editor here, and I'll, I'll go ahead and drop in a couple other elements just so you can kind of see how Thrive Architect works. Let's say I wanted paragraphs here, or paragraph or text. So this is some text, and I'll just go ahead and copy that paste it a couple times just so you can see how that looks and you can see here I'm I'm building a site very simply very easily I'm, I'm getting the basic elements of, of a site so I'll say basic header and then I can choose to center that right here um, and this is all just clicking and dragging and I'm building out the page here you can do this for a post you can do this for a whole page on your on your website it really just depends on what you want to do. Let's say you want to add like a little cool countdown clock right here for like a product launch. You can do that. Um, there's just so many different elements that you can add in here. You can see you have the ability to add in custom HTML if you do want to add in specific lines of code. Um, let's say it's like a blog post and at the bottom you want Facebook comments for feedback. Well, you can just drop it in just like that and then you would tie in the URL there. You can change the color scheme and then decide how it, you know, handles that specific module there and they have a whole bunch of different modules and elements i should say for you to work with whether it is lead generation post grids tables toggles um, if you want to add like a video right here at the middle you can go ahead and insert that via youtube or what have you again there's just so many different things for you to really design your page and really make your own um, and, and no one you know page is the same with something like thrive architect you can really make it uniquely yours Another really great aspect of Thrive Architect is the ability to take all of this and then see it in real time how it adjusts depending on the site you're on. So if you're on a tablet, this is what the site would look like. If you are on a mobile device, then it's going to look like this. So you can instantly see how it's going to respond to your, um, you know, to different uh, resolutions, different devices. And again, the same thing if I was to choose um, a different template. So if I was to go with any other template here. You can see some of their other templates that they offer here. I can go ahead and just jump between the views to see how they would look like on the desktop, on the tablet, on the mobile device. So you automatically know what that experience is going to look like for all of your users. So tablet, mobile device, and I can go ahead and scroll and see how that scales as needed. Uh, again, you have more options here. You can see things like the revision manager. You can choose to um, undo or redo certain changes that you made to a template or your design. But again, there's just so many different options here when it comes to Thrive Architect. Um, if you use WordPress uh, and you love the platform itself, but you really want more customization on how you design your site, you don't want just another generic theme, then this is definitely something to look into. Uh, furthermore, you can click down below at any point in this video to go ahead and try out and get Thrive Architect uh, through Thrive, uh, Thrive Themes. Um, again, it's just such a really, really great uh, plugin to have, a really great assistance to WordPress. No more confusing short codes or, you know, installation addition, installing like two or three or four plugins. This is all included in one. You can create these beautiful content, great pages, uh, just using, again, the standard uh, a WordPress editor, it's not even possible <laughs> to do such things like you're seeing here on screen. Um, again, if you want to build a blog at WordPress.com, you can use this plugin if you buy the business plan um, where you can install third party plugins or themes. However, if you get the lower package and you can't use this plugin, so keep that in mind. So that all said, if you are interested in Thrive Architect, you can click on the link down below uh, and you get a couple options here. There's two options of payments. First off, you can pay a one-time fee uh, starting from $67, and that's just the single license here, and that goes up depending on how many licenses you need uh, for your websites, if you have one or multiple. Uh, your other option, like I mentioned earlier, is to become a Thrive member and get access to Thrive Architect. Um, with the Thrive membership, you uh, go from about 19 
fifteen dollars per month that's paid annually, uh, and you get access to a lot of different products. And and just to kind of you know showcase a few, you have Thrive Architect, which we just talked about, a really great you know intuitive drag and drop editor for WordPress. You have other things like Thrive Leads, Thrive Clever Widgets, um, and actually if you want to see some more uh, content from Thrive, you can see our, our video down below. Again, we have a link down there to other reviews. Um, but yeah, again, you get a lot with the Thrive membership, so it's kind of an all-in-one package deal. Of course, your purchases are protected by a 30-day money-back guarantee and HTTPS protocol, so there's no risk on your side. And again, with that, if you're looking to build a really great site via WordPress, then look no further than Thrive Architect via Thrive Themes.